You okay, sweetie? I'm not really a man. My dog died, you know, all of a sudden. I think that would be the end of me. What would you do about it? I think I'd have to get help. Hello, my name is Gus. Now, the reason you're here is because you've typed in I'm fucked, I'm screwed, or I'm bollocksed into your search bar and you've Googled it. Are you a professional, like an analyst or something? No. What's up with you, pal? I feel afraid all the time. What we're gonna do is, you're gonna go away, you're gonna put together a list of all the good reasons to go on living, you're gonna put it into a presentation for me, and I'm gonna listen to it. I've put together my presentation uh, into uh, five different categories. Can I help you? I saw Sonny listen a few days ago, Chad. Any ugly? Four different categories. You look confused. I'm looking for a plant, you know, something that'll grow. Something that can grow. Look, I thought this was about helping me. Thomas Aquinas? This is something available to all of us. Irish people, I mean. The idea that when we die, we somehow become part of something sublime and voluptuous. Fucking sir, that's... The exercise won't really be complete unless you have a little look at Eastern mythology. I have to warn you though, you may have to do an awful lot of wanking before you achieve a tantric ejaculation. <laughs> but I really do think you should at least give it a try. You see, I've been thinking and... I don't actually think that I'm looking for a reason to live. I'm actually looking for a reason to die.